she looks she looks like vomit. That's just, that's just the graphics. <laughs> Touche. <laughs> Look at the bricks in this game. It looks flat. It's well, like Thief 1. You got a problem with that? You know, you got a problem? Well, how do you know? They could be wallpaper bricks. It's <laughs> right into the camera. Jesus. Were they high when they made this game? <laughs> do I need to answer? <laughs> no. What are, are these expressions? These are fucking creepy. <laughs> she looks like a mutant. Fuck. Legendary super mute? Yeah, legends speak of him being a super mutant. But no one can really confirm that he is in fact a super mutant. <laughs> He's the super duperest mutant ever. She looks like a mutant. Fuck. <laughs> a mutant fuck? Yeah. yeah. Something a mutant one fuck? Yeah. <laughs> that legendary super mutant. He's legendary because he would. Got him! <laughs> Got him! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Piper. Yep. AKA Fancy Fran. Fancy Fran. Yeah. Suck your dick so fancy, <laughs> it'll come out in a knot. <laughs> wow. That is technique. <laughs> Not every day you can meet a meet a gal. Gal. I can do that for you. Goyle. Yeah, and she's, Goyle. she's got a tongue that's as long as a real snake. An actual snake. Wow. An actual snake. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow. Oh, wow. Wow. It's like a wolf mix of wow. Wow. <laughs> wow. It's like a yep. conglo conglomerate of gangs. Like, well, how how could this be a single gang? You know what I'm saying? This is no way this is just a single gang. Nah. This, this is like a confederation of gangs. Well, it, it's becoming more and more clear to me that in the post apocalypse, I can't get anything right. That includes the organization <laughs> of uh, a gang. Yeah, the problem isn't that there's like not enough people organizing, but that there's too many people organizing under one person. <laughs> you can't actually run it properly. Exactly. They're just all talking about fucking goils and fucking snake tongues. Yeah, snake and tongues. He's trying to get them to just like work a single day in their life, and they're like, nah. Stop playing. Stop playing the answer blaster. <laughs> For one second, I'm asking you, stop playing the answer blaster. <laughs> like grandmas in rocking chairs. <laughs> we need to we need to get together and stop them from playing any more of that acid blaster. <laughs> All right, first we're gonna have our knitting party, but that's about it. Is that what they were doing here? They're not really a gang. They're just they're just hobbyists. Yeah. They have one hobby that unites them. <laughs> Wearing fedoras and knitting. Everybody's gonna have something. That's like that's, that's actually one hobby and one like you think that's like two separate hobbies? No. Nope. It's a single hobby. Well, he's dead now. And we can take his stuff. A missile launcher sounds pretty good. M m a Mister Launcher. Yeah, mistletoe launcher. Everybody has to kiss. Before you have a crush on a girl, it explodes. Per perfect item. You just shove, you just shove it in her face and pull the trigger. Girls love that kind yeah. of stuff, you know. I would know. I have no friends. Everybody, I would know. Everybody knows. <laughs> With some turkey and some mistletoe. I know. It's to get her mouth used to having something in it, you know. Wow. <laughs> This is this is the sort of uh, raunchy high garbage humor that uh, we're well known for. Yeah, clearly. Well, I have a perfect defense for my indefensible behavior. Okay. I have no friends. Oh, <laughs> they all abandoned you. Yeah. Yeah. Well. 
Hey, you, can, you always have to make good on a bad situation. Good news for people who love great news. Yeah. Well, really, the deal breaker of my friends was not that I broke balls too much, as you'd expect. Yeah. But they were all poodle owners, and you know how I feel about poodles. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow, yeah. Yeah, why would you ever want to become a friend with a poodle owner? Well, I didn't know that, and that's how I also found out that I'm a poodle puncher. Yeah. So. I mean. Well, when you go and, you know, kill everybody's poodles, especially the ones that Who are your, my friends, friends, yeah. your friends own, yeah. yeah. I can see why that. Well, they friend zone me is the first problem. Oh. Yeah. He could have gone further with them and their poodle. Yeah, but I ended up punching the poodle so hard that my knuckles broke. So after I was done killing their poodle, they also had to drive me to the hospital. Wow. <laughs> well, I don't know what's incredible that you've done this once or you've done this multiple times. No, no, not once. I mean. A poodle puncher like me will not pull his punches far the time, you know? Well, yeah, you won't stop, can't stop. I get it. I get it. Head didn't explode. Well, you never, you can never expect every head to explode. Yeah. You can't get them all, you know? You fucking hurt my dog. Well... You hurt their dog, now they're gonna hurt your dog. You know dog. They're hanging out with a skeleton, that's very progressive. It's nice for the skeleton, it doesn't have to feel like he's been left out. Well, he likes, you know, he likes to meet a diverse cast of people. Well, I'm, gra I'm glad they, you know, threw him a bone. <laughs> Oh my god. You just you just keep it coming. You really do. What can I do? I feel better already. Knowing we have a reliable supply of clean water. I hope you don't mind me asking for some more help. But our God, I'm trying to talk to my wife who get the fuck out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. You just got fucking blasted in the head <laughs> before the fucking crime of speaking to me out of order. <laughs> you shall not speak to me unless spoken to. Now he just feels really bad. He just walked away. He just took it. <laughs> He's like feeling really depressed now. He had a really tough day and he saw you. He was so happy. He came running over to you. And he just like shot him in the face eight times. Unprovoked. Well, provoked a little bit. And then just sad shit. He just come goes crawling away. <laughs> he just has boogers just fucking hanging from his face as he fucking slouches off. What did I do? What did I do? Are we seriously gonna have this problem again? Are we seriously gonna have this problem again? In the same yeah. spot, same guy, same fucking problem again. Told you not to fuck with me, man. <laughs> <laughs> Told you next time I'm coming through and I see you sleeping? Oh, Piper hated that. Oh, oh, oh. No, I'm disciplining him. This is not your business. This is not, this is not your business. All of you could just die. Die, die, die. That's Todd Howard. Die, die, die. It's civil war over someone not working. <laughs> <laughs> this, this was the, uh, the strike. The worker strike. This was the last straw. Everyone's turned on me over that. <laughs> it's the last, last straw. Even you, Cal? Even you.